Nothing complements a Coke product like the smooth taste of Coke 45. Tonight, we welcome Aaron Perlut, chairman of the American Mustache Institute. How you doing, Aaron? Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Reese. The feeling is mutual. Absolutely. Now, I must ask, what are the qualifications to become the chairman of the American Mustache Institute? Well, you know, I've been with the American Mustache Institute since 1988. We were founded in 1965, and I think it's really a commitment to the sexually dynamic mustached American lifestyle and, and being willing to really lay down your life for uh, fighting for the civil liberties of people of mustached American heritage. Now, i got to ask you, one problem I've had since I've grown my mustache, how many times have you been asked for a mustache ride? You know, it's interesting in, in that you're, you're a barefaced mortal, and so it's, 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 it's kind of an obvious question. But within the mustached American community, we typically don't even discuss that because the sexual dynamism is, uh, of our lifestyle requires that it's, it's not even uh, necessary to bring it up. Uh, so let's just move on. Aaron, if somebody is deciding whether to sport a mustache or not, what do the statistics say? Well, you know, uh, science that comes out of the American Mustache Institute indicates that uh, a mustache will improve good looks by 38%. It's one reason that we have lobbied Congress for a $200 annual tax break. Um, so there is, you know, there's great opportunities to improve your good looks, also your intellect and your earning capacity with having a mustache. Aaron, this weekend, the St. Louis Rams will be hosting a stash bash in honor of Jeff Fisher during their home opener against the Washington Redskins. How excited are you for this event, and how much better will the Rams play because of it? Well, you know, it's almost, you know, everything's kind of, the chickens are coming home to roost uh, in that St. Louis is the home of the world's largest mustache, the Gateway Arch, and it the professional football team there now, the Rams, are owned by Stan Kroenke, who, of course, is one of three mustached American owners in the National Football League. And we now have one of the six uh, head coaches of mustached American descent, Jeff Fisher, on our sidelines. And you know, as you mentioned, they're going to be handing out these mustaches uh, this weekend to everyone that comes to uh, attendance at the Edward Jones Dome, so all 438 but that should be able to break the record because they're trying to break a Guinness Book of World Records at the Edward Jones Dome, uh, which is about 237. So it's going to be an, an incredible festivity. And my hat's off to the Rams for really celebrating uh, the mustached American people in our community, which has really faced discrimination at, at every, uh, every corner of, of this country, sadly. And it, it's great to have an organization that is owned and operated by mustached American management. Now, Aaron, you had a chance to sit down with Coach Jeff Fisher to discuss his infamous stash. Let's take a look. Uh, you know, it seems wherever you've gone as a head coach, there's been a nation with, uh, with your mustache, and it's been no different here in St. Louis. Well, why do you think that is? I really have no idea. I mean, I've, you know, I've coached with a beard down in Nashville with a goatee. Um, you know, it's really all up to my daughter. You know, they're going to be handing out these to everyone that comes in the stadium. Is this your greatest professional achievement? Uh, no, I'm going to shave it Sunday morning. You know that according to biblical te texts, each time a mustache is shaved, an angel in heaven dies and falls to earth, right? Is that right? It's true. No, I wasn't aware of that. So, you know, finally, uh, let's get you out of here on this. Every year, the American Mustache Institute seeks its Robert Goulet Memorial Mustached American of the Year. Mm -hmm. In 2012, is that going to be Jeff Fisher? You know, that's up to the committee. You know, I would be extremely honored, but that's up to the committee. Aaron, two things. First of all, I actually feel 40% more attractive with this stash on. It is a French stash, though. And uh, you got to sit down with the coach face to face. How amazing is the mustache in person? You know, it was an interesting process um, it, coming face to face. Having that much rugged good looks in one room was, I think, a challenge for both of us um, because typically mustached Americans do not move around in packs. We move around individually, uh, much, like, much like Sasquatches. Yes. Uh, but, it, you know, I think it was a great experience. We, uh, we embraced both before and after and really felt the warmth of our togetherness. 
Thank you so much. That's uh, Aaron Perlut who joined us. He's the chairman of the American Mustache Institute, shag carpet and not wearing underwear. Thank you so much for coming on the show. Thank you, Rich. Appreciate it.